Walmart is turned on. And so am I. That's right. After being laughed out of town when their overpowered series of gaming desktops received universally negative reviews, Walmart is now back with a full slew of gaming peripherals. We got speakers, monitors, webcams, microphones, keyboards, mice, desk pads, and even the desk itself. Some of it's good. Some of it literally smells like poo. And I'll tell you all about it after this segue to our sponsor, NZXT. NZXT wants to make building a custom PC easier. With NZXT Build, just set a budget, see how the computer performs with your favorite games, and Build takes care of the rest. Use the link below to get your own custom PC today. Our journey begins with the aptly named Home Trends Computer Desk. They helpfully left out words like trendy or deluxe. And they do admit that it's made of PVC. It has a soft closed door though. Oh, well, hold on, sorry. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Having not seen the listing on their site, I'm guessing 119 Canadian dollars. Oh, wow. Well, you're not, you said Canadian? I said Canadian. You're $10 over on the Canadian price. I'm $10 over. Wow, well, that's pretty good. I'm not saying I'd pay that for it. Yeah, and especially when you consider that you could just go to Ikea, do the classic like countertop plus four legs and a set of Alex drawers. For half the price, yes. Well. Oh, for a little, little if you get the Alex drawers, it's like $10 more. Certainly it'll be larger. <laughs> this is like a little Linus size desk. Well, we brought you a little Linus size chair. Ew. What makes this a gaming chair? Um, Other than that it's RGB sort of. This isn't the actual gaming chair that we got you. This is just uh, their default office chair. I see. Um, their this game is their default office chair? Whose office has, you know what? To their credit, the butt cushion on this is actually better than almost any chair I've ever encountered under like a hundred bucks. Yeah, that might be true for the first half hour. I'm guessing, no, I'm guessing $89.99. Uh, US or Canadian? Canadian. It's $69.99 Canadian. It's $69.99 wow. Canadian. Yeah. And if feasibly, if it's for like a child who's very lightweight, the foam was probably gonna be plenty of support. And it is kind of child sized along with this desk. Let's get some gaming accessories. I think the first thing we have to start with is our monitor. Oh, that's a cute pun. I thought the monitor was just called the game, which I guess I lost now. Uh... <laughs> but it's game on, which I guess is more just their slogan. And the product is the curved QHD gaming monitor. Ooh. Well, that's definitely for gamers. It's very light. <laughs> Are you getting the point based on like how easily I can wiggle yeah. this around? You've got what used to be speaker grills down here. Clearly this is a repurposed chassis from a different model of display because there's no speakers in there. Uh, you got HDMI 1, HDMI 2, and display port. There's your power in, external power brick, and a headphone jack. Base mounting though, that's always nice to have. And it's got joystick style controls. Nice, quick, and easy assembly so far, though. It's completely toolless up till now. Wow, this is surprising. It comes with both a display port and an HDMI cable, which isn't a big deal for a high-end monitor, but for budget monitors where they're trying to save every couple of dollars, it's an, it's an unexpected inclusion. It means that it'll be ready to go for both your gaming PC and your console, if you're in your dorm room or whatever, right out of the box. I'm saying this puppy is $239.99 US. 209 US. 209, okay, well I'm glad I didn't go higher. And wait, it's even got height adjust. Okay, none of that. Wow, suck on that, Apple. Oh! Do these have on branding on them? No, these are just the most generic DisplayPort cables that's, I've ever seen. That's funny because they actually sell on HDMI cables and on premium HDMI cables for twice the price. Oh, uh, what makes the premium ones premium? The price. <laughs> I mean, before we get anywhere, we need something to plug it into. Protect on. Oh, I thought it was a joke. When it was like game on. Yeah, they even, they're still making puns here. Hang on. What hang on? Oh, I get and, it. And you know, protect on, that thing that hang? everyone says. Yeah, protect on. Yeah. <laughs> Holy crap. This is dollar store grade. <laughs> but with five volt, 2.4 amp shared charging. Man, I'm sorry. I know this is gonna derail things a little bit. Do you wanna guess the price before we go in there? The price better not be more than like 10 bucks. 25. This boy got mashed. 
initially I thought there was absolutely nothing clamping down this main AC power cord. Like I thought you could just pull on this thing and it would just heave on the solder joints, but that's not actually the case. The plastic molding has these little ribs that use this screw and this one to kind of uh, clamp down on it. it. To be clear, it's not great, <laughs> but it's something. Well, let's get you to the accessories. We're back to gaming on. Yes. Oh, this is a mechanical keyboard. Hey. Oh, that's, that's why it's called RGB mechanical <laughs> keyboard. Satisfying sharp click. Well, I think satisfying and sharp is a little optimistic. Also, do they mention what kind of blue switches? No, they don't, but these are extremely twangy, cheap blue switches. Plastic base, but metal deck. Actually decent flex. Multiple cable channels, height adjust. I'd never buy it at this price because I recognize the legend on the keys and I know that you can get boards from this manufacturer for like 40 to 45 US dollars, but I'm gonna say this one is 60. 44.94. Really? Yeah. With the wrist rest and everything, all right. I just wanna highlight, I was taking a look through the quick start guide because I think quick start guides for things like keyboards are funny. Here's a way that they cut some costs. You can download the software at their website, but do you think that they paid money to get onn.com? Oh. No, it's www.onn2.tech. Oh. <laughs> Braided cable, storage for the dongle and the base. Okay. You got my attention, ONN. No, you're supposed to say you're turning me on. <laughs> Color indicated DPI cycling, probably. Forward and back buttons on both sides is ambidextrous. I'm kind of into this. If this is less than like 45 bucks, then I like it a lot. Type C charging. Oh. What? Got Logitech B. 3688. What? Okay. Man, we've now done Monoprice, Amazon Basics, and I think AliExpress for gaming setups. I think Walmart might be coming out ahead right now. What are the flipping odds? Especially given their inauspicious start in the category. They haven't gone the Amazon route of trying to do everything. They have a lot of different stuff under the on brand, but they're not like trying to make 20 different versions of any, everything, which seems good. This could be for now though. It could get much worse. They could end up sprawling and making a bunch of... Well, we haven't tried any of it yet. Yeah. It's still plenty of time for it to be terrible. How much is the wired one? I would guess around the same price, given that it has very similar specs. Uh, oh, it does have a different body type. Well, with all the savings they can make on shipping those lightweight mice, they come in at 2488. Do you have the scale? Is the scale here? I don't think the lightweight mouse is light. 100 grams. And I'm even supporting the cable here. How much is the wireless one? 110, and it has a battery in it. <laughs> and for context, the Superlight is 63 grams. Yeah. All right, see you later. We have much better boxes for our mouse pads, just wanna say. LTTstore.com, much higher quality packaging. Oh God, it's RGB. Here's your micro B power input. All right. The top fabric is nothing special. This is a freebie grade mouse pad, but with RGB strapped to it. I would never pay this, but I'm assuming it's like 20 bucks. 16.88. Okay. If you want to stream. Uh. Surf on ring light webcam with autofocus, 1440p resolution. Oh, that's a mistake. And a built-in microphone. I think the built-in ring light is probably worth an extra five bucks. So I'm saying it's $20. The webcam with ring light comes to $29.94. Juice on, wireless charging lamp. Charging pad wirelessly charges your Qi enabled device. LED charging indicator. Oh, okay. You can kind of position it wherever you want. I mean, I'm sure it's not high CRI or whatever, but like if you just want a little LED lamp to, wow, it really stays exactly where you put it. Very adjustable. What's CRI? Uh, CRI, I actually don't know what it stands for, but I know that, sorry? Color rendering, index. Color rendering index. Basically what it means is that the light outputs within a very narrow band of the visible spectrum. So you don't just have uh, messy wavelengths that are not supposed to be there. Might not be super accurate because we, we do have filming light here, but like if we get really close, that's 82. 
That's that's actually not terrible. Not bad. Actually, but the red channel is really bad. Right. Okay. So if we're filming, don't buy this light. Does the wireless charging work? Only one way to find out. Ah. Uh. Yep. Oh. Immediately. And for only 1988. Not bad. Yeah. Of course. We need some way to listen to audio. Yeah, because it sure isn't going to be through the empty speaker holes on our monitor. Break the silence. The days of lip reading on your PC are over. What? These better not be more than 25 bucks. These speakers with volume and bass control are $19. Nice! But oh, I mean, wow. that's, that's been a good trend is that you've been overestimating most. Well, it's of the more that I just thought like with inflation, you know, cheap, crappy computer speakers were 20 bucks when I was a kid. So I kind of thought, well, surely they've gone up a little. Like, I, I haven't shopped for them since then, right? And now for the piece de la resistance, the Walmart computer. What? It doesn't exist. They've been shamed out of existence. They don't make any computers anymore. Really? Yeah, there's no pre -builts. They don't even have laptops for sale anymore, just their tablets. So is this based on parts that are available on Walmart's website or is this just a test bench? This from... is just my test bench. Oh, okay. There we go. It's on. E -e. It was funnier when I did it. <laughs> what is this wallpaper? I'm that's sorry, a, I'm going to... The, that... Hey, no, this is, this is my test bench. I, have, I chose my wallpaper. Oh my God, you set this wallpaper and then <laughs> the activation window closed and now it cannot be changed. What can I say? I'm a hacker, man. I can... <laughs> they came. This has been a while. Oh. Oh! Yeah, they like literally just got oh, delivered. this is great! We've got our headset. I think we should uh, maybe consider these for WAN show, because I don't know if we have podcast mics. Oh. <laughs> Rechargeable and wireless. And based on the pricing I've seen so far, I'm going to guess, I don't know, 65 bucks? The wireless gaming headset is $52. 52 bucks! And I still managed to come in over. Comes with both a USB-C charging cable. And a three and a half millimeter, uh, it's a four pole jack. <laughs> four pole? Yeah. So, well, okay. Oh, for that... the, oh, no, it's not four. I was thinking like, like audiophile four pole. This is just because it has the mic on the same oh. plug. Yes. Yeah. It's been a while since I've been this impressed by a budget product lineup. Every single one of these, I have overestimated the price. Walmart, you heard it here first. Put that on your box. Cheaper than Linus expected. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And you know what? Holy crap, this is not a TN panel. What? It's not a good non-TN panel, but it's not TN. I'd say it's IPS, because you can really see that blue glow when it's off axis. To be clear, that's not a bad thing at all. Wait, onto.tech? www.onto.tech. Wait, holy tech. crap. It doesn't even load up a site. It just immediately starts downloading the setup software. <laughs> uh, not sketchy. That is absolutely terrifying. As an end user, I would not, if I wasn't making this video, I would not want to open any file that just automatically downloads when I visit a URL. It didn't even, like, look at this. I didn't even realize it was downloading something. Like, watch this. It doesn't even change the page I'm on. Professional sound quality uh -huh. with cardioid recording pattern. Ideal for podcasts, vlogs, and voiceovers. Say it again. Testing, testing, is this thing on? Damn it, they took the joke from us. This is one of those products where I have seen impressive, cheap cardioid desktop mics. So, it's entirely possible this thing doesn't suck. That's not bad. Even with this light right behind me though, that is very usable for 30 bucks. Have you turned the ring light on? Huh, I have no idea how to turn the ring light Probably on. Probably a bum case. Sweat. Oh, ah, 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 what just happened? Uh, is it touch? Oh, it's touch. It's up here, it's right, there's a label right there. Now let's try the ring light. Um, <laughs> it's it underwhelming. Is, it's like no brighter than your display. Oh, wow. Yeah, check this out, David. How can you have below zero? For context, let's go ahead and measure one of our studio lights. We're at 96, and you can see the biggest difference is this red channel here. 
that's really, really important for natural skin tones because of all the you know, blood coursing behind our skin. So if you have a streaming light with absolutely no red channel output, it shouldn't be surprising that you look like a ghost, or at least I do. We forgot to record the audio, so let's do this again. We're gonna start with the microphone right on the webcam and I was supposed to play games, like I'm a streamer right now or something like that. It's not working very well. We just applied a driver update from AMD and the, the game is just, it's not working. So let's switch over to the headset mic and I'll give you guys an audio sample from that. And yeah, this is crazy. Like I'm firing. I can't, I can't see anything. So let's just go back to the Windows desktop and let's give the podcaster microphone a couple of different chances here. First, from its position right now under the monitor. And then second, there we go. If you want to try and get it a little closer to your mouth in front of the keyboard, eh, it's not the most ergonomic thing ever, but Walmart doesn't have an arm. So as a Walmart gamer, I guess I don't get an arm. Give it a chance to kind of sound a little richer and more podcasty. I can't hear any of this. You guys are going to have to be the judges. So it turns out these microphones are really spicy and you need to turn them way down in windows to get them not to clip like insanely. Uh, so here's one with them not clipping. This is the podcast microphone. It's placed right in front of me. Uh, and then here's some keystrokes in the background. You know, what if I'm typing a message and then here's the audio for the webcam. Same deal. Keystrokes in the background. Let us know what you think. Uh, hopefully they sound a little bit better than when Linus did it. Thirteen, fourteen-year-old me would have been happier than a pig in to have a setup like this. Like... Would thirteen or fourteen-year-old you want one of these? Wait, what is this? This is what happens when you search gaming chair on Walmart. It's the X Rocker Play 2.0 Floor Rocker Gaming Chair. It's got two speakers in it, folds for storage. It can't be worse than what I'm sitting on right now. Okay, I kind of want this. Ew, it smells like a fart. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Smell it. Oh my god, it's, it smells like actual horse <laughs> like, <laughs> It can't be that bad. Oh my it's god, pretty, no, David. It smells pure. It's, it actually smells like poo. <laughs> what the f***? <laughs> Why? What do they do? I don't know, but it smells really bad. I don't want to sit on the poo chair. <laughs> Here's your audio input. It runs on five volt, one amp power. Huh. I give you my personal Linus Tech Tips guarantee that these speakers sound as bad as they smell. I've How heard enough, this thing sucks. Can we please return this one? <laughs> yes, yeah, okay. it smells like I really do not want to have this in the building, and I'm gonna say seventy-five dollars. Uh, Ninety-nine. <laughs> no. <laughs> they their two point one version comes on a pedestal, so you can sit at couch height, and that's two hundred and seventy-eight. No. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna wait any longer to tell you about our sponsor. Thanks to Grammarly for sponsoring this video. Whether you're job hunting or just trying to get all your work done before heading out for vacation for this summer, Grammarly is here for you. Grammarly is an all-in-one writing tool that helps you with grammar and spelling suggestions that help professionals save time. Simply install the free desktop app, log in and start typing like normal. There's also Grammarly Premium, which provides more in-depth feedback on your writing. It's got advanced features to help you feel more confident in your writing and to save you even more time. We recommend checking out the tone transformation and clarity suggestion tools to make your writing more compelling. They help you by rewording phrases to make you sound more confident and by removing unnecessary jargon to help you get your point across more clearly. A group of people here at LMG on our business team use Grammarly to help them make their workflow more efficient. It helps them save time proofreading important emails and documents as Grammarly helps them get it right the first time. So work smarter, not harder. Go to grammarly.com slash LTT to sign up for a free account and get 20% off Grammarly Premium today. It has to be plugged into the power strip. That's a 3070 Ti. You got a $45,000 warranty, dude. Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm gonna get so many 3070 Ti's if this thing blows up. You know, I've always wondered why people ask so much for dead hardware on eBay and stuff. I guess insurance fraud could be a reason. Just put it in a, your house burns down, so you just find a bunch of computer hardware, put it in a fire, huck it in the remains, and then. Good tech tip. <laughs> no, no, no.